Hello you guys, good morning. It's Becky, your sketching pal based in Hong Kong. But today I think I'm just going to take you more so of a day in the life. Um, currently bringing a lot of trash that I've already sorted and I'm heading to the recycling center. That's my morning. Uh, but basically what happens um, today, or the plan for today, is that I've been so overwhelmed or just like not so overwhelmed, but I've just been dealing with a little bit of a change. Um, started a new job and it doesn't require me to work from home as much. So I'm thinking of doing like a big, big, big D stash because I don't need a lot of stuff at home. And I have all the stuff I need at work. And I don't know if I will need that stuff again, but I think I'll just wanna de stash it and declutter. And if I need something, then I'll just purchase it again or acquire it at a later time. Um, but yeah, welcome to a day in the life. And we're gonna try this vlog thing out. Now that we're done with recycling, I'm going to head out to my workout, which I do three times a week. And this is going to be three out of three. So let's go. really tiring one but it's a good one um, I'm glad that I did it and I think now I can really kickstart my weekend um, so I was going to go and go straight home to buy some groceries just so I can meal prep for next week but after class I got a really exciting notification that something arrived at the post office for me so we're gonna pick it up right now I also realized like I don't look the best at the moment but you know, this is real life. After a workout, I am super sweaty and um, and my hair is not done. So, welcome to my real life. Oh my god, I am so excited. I might just unbox this later. So this quickly turned from a D-Stash vlog to a haul vlog a little bit. Um, basically, this is something that I was hunting not for a while, literally just for the past like two weeks. And I got like really lucky because someone was selling um, a pre-owned something something that we are going to reveal in a bit and I'm really excited. Uh, all right, I'll see you guys in a bit. We still have to do groceries and everything. So um, the vlog will get going. Welcome back everyone to a really spontaneous and quick unboxing. Um, I'm going to try and make it as quick as possible because I am kind of hungry after my workout and I can't start um, any of my rice cooker and cooking and stuff until I get this out of the way because otherwise it'll be so noisy and you would hear the rice cooker, you would hear the stove, etc, etc. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna cook to be honest because I like I picked up some bamboo shoots because I really like it But I have no idea how to cook bamboo shoots or what recipe to do with them Thinking of doing something a little bit Indonesian, but I don't even know how we use it in Indonesia So I need to figure it out. Maybe make some own fusion thing. But anyway, the big reveal 
Ah, oh my god. Okay, I don't know if I'm ready for this, but we will be ready. Uh, so this is from Food Fan, aka Jacob. He posted something on sale a couple of days ago on Instagram, and I really wanted it. I was on the hunt for it. Um, I couldn't find it in Hong Kong, so I was actually really happy that he was selling. Here are his pre-owned blotter. Oh my god, it's a blotter. Oh, also this ink is so beautiful. <gasps> wow, okay. He's selling his pre-owned plotter. I don't know where to find it in Hong Kong, but I was listening to um, or viewing a lot of Job's journals videos and I think I'm just like in love with the thought of ring binder because I always thought that ring binders were really cool. I, was, I used them a lot actually in my school days, especially when I was in middle school because I thought it was really neat that you could kind of bring in and out the pages as you see fit. And because I am a petite woman and have always been a petite woman, I really like value the fact that you can make it lighter or heavier as you need it be because I want the least weight possible on my back. So thanks so much, Jacob. Uh, thanks for letting me buy this off of you. So now we are going to just slowly open this up. I love like preserving packaging as well. Um, and also because, well, later today I'm going to take you with me. I need to shop for my secret Santa. So I think I was hitting like sort of a plateau in what I wanted to acquire in terms of stationery and journaling and sketching and fountain pens and stuff. And I thought it'd be fun to have a secret Santa so that not only can I share some of the Hong Kong exclusive like inks and stuff to other people, but I can also um, receive some stuff that I never would buy for myself. And I think that's often the best way you discover something is if someone else gets it for you, right? Actually, I'm gonna keep this because it's so cute. Not me hoarding already, but I think Job would save this in his journal. So I might try to do the same. I don't even have a travel journal to journal in, but anyway. Ah, thank you, Jacob. Ah, is this the box? It's like, so I've never seen this in real life before. Um, I had no idea what to expect. This is a lot smaller than I thought it would because like for comparison, let me just pull this. This is the bullet journal that I use every day. Like it's really, really big. And I actually, I love the size, but I sometimes feel that it's a bit too big for me. So I am glad to be able to downsize to something a little bit smaller, perhaps. I might be digging myself into a grave here. I don't know where to buy the binder refills um, for plotters. So plotter is a ring binder, um, but you need to buy the refills, kind of similar like how Traveler's Notebook is like the leather and you need to buy all the inserts and stuff. Um, did not foresee this YouTube channel becoming a planner channel, but oh my God. Okay. Oh, am I ready? Jacob put some inserts in. I did tell Jacob like if he has some extra refills, I would love to like buy it off of him. But I think he gave it to me free of charge. So I really actually need to, um... oh, this is beautiful. I need to ask him how much more I should pay him because oh my God, these are amazing. Oh, oh I love, I love that they're plain. I think because school has always been like line and stuff. I like gravitate now more towards the plain and the dotted um, pages because I think I love to draw like diagrams and just like arrows from one point to another. Thanks, Jacob. Okay, we ready for the reveal? Okay, let's put this here for now. So this is the description of the different plotters. What is this? Oh, okay, it's a certificate. Okay, I'm just gonna put it right here. <gasps> Bowen of Truth, you guys. Oh my god. Oh, this is already like so pretty and so proper. No. Way! Oh my god. Ah! Okay, this is like, this is actually really gorgeous. Oh, love. Love, 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 love. Okay. Okay, okay. Ah, okay. All right. 
get yourself together, Becky. Um, I think this is the guide. So Jacob did mention that he noticed some scuff marks here, so he actually like knocked off the price by like about 10, 20 bucks, which is really nice of him. But wow, this feels so good. It feels so different from my traveler's notebook, which I've just left at work, so I can't even show you. But wow, look at the size comparison, you guys. Oh my god. How does it work? Oh, that feels expensive. Like, oh, that sound. Anyway, all right. I'm gonna stop right here. I don't even know how I'm gonna set it up. So I think for now, I might, I don't know, should I? I'm thinking of like not even using my, I have a traveler's notebook that I bought for like work, but now I'm like thinking, should I just do this? Because, um, so the thing with my new job is I really don't know how I would use my planner just yet. Um, mainly because I don't know what's gonna be needed for day to day and stuff. So I might try both. I don't know how I'm gonna try both. Um, I might try to acquire some inserts for the, um, uh, the new year and stuff and just see where we go from there but oh my god thank you so much jacob for sending me this gracious gracious thing and i'll need to take a picture and now i'm gonna start cooking oh my god this unboxing is like eight minutes i need to i need to cut it down so hopefully by the time you guys see it it's only a few minutes bye see you in a bit decluttered so much stuff um, I did this all in an hour and I was so tempted to just like throw it in the trash right across my building but nope we're gonna make our way to a donation center it's so thick I had to double bag it oh my god okay. <clears throat> I haven't really shopped for clothes since COVID and oh, there are so many clothes that I'm not even using um, so and I wear like kind of the repeat outfits every day. So I think it wasn't even hard for me to declutter. I don't know why it took me so long to actually get rid of some of the stuff that I got rid of. But um, I feel good. I think like, I'm like just feeling a little bit overwhelmed with the amount of stuff that I have. So I'm just trying to kind of not think too much. Marie Kondo the heck out of it looking at my dresses, which I don't wear a lot because they don't have pockets or most of them don't. The ones that do are in my closet. Yeah, I just took up a lot of dresses that do not have pockets. Thank them for their service. Put them in the bag. All right, now for the exciting bit, I'm gonna bring you guys to Muse Pens, which is my favorite fountain pen store here in Hong Kong, or maybe like one of the only ones. And we're gonna shop for my secret Santa on the fountain pens subreddit. Let's go. Just arriving at the fountain pen shop, Muse Pens. <laughs> and picking out inks. Yeah, sure, sure. So uh, I'm looking for some inks from uh, 
for a friend and they try to um they don't want blue sheen inks mm -hmm. but they want to try so diamond exclusive i thought of land rock and i want to try some of these other inks maybe i i oh uh, yeah sure 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 maybe this one it's like this one. one okay Okay. And then the Fenta is this one. It's quite nice actually. The one? Yes. It's our new new collection. And pick the like the medium like color because you get you get the dark color. Yeah. And then the lion roll also is the dark color. Mm. And this one is like the light color. Well, yeah. So you, you can pick the medium okay. style. Yes. Okay. Mm. Mission success! I managed to get a bunch of stuff for my secret Santa. I might throw in some stuff as well back at home from my stash. Now I'm actually gonna head off to meet some friends. I'll see you all again when we are de-stashing. See you in a bit. Alright, so this is de-stash time. These are the pens that I was cleaning earlier. So I had originally a white ink in this Kaweco Sport, but it dried up. Um, so maybe that's a heads up for the Atramentus document. White doesn't really work. Um, this is a Sailor Pro Gear Slim Mini. And I did not enjoy the writing experience of this. So I'm gonna also sell this. I just listed it on Carousel, which is a secondhand website. Um, so that is one other D stash that's going to happen. Think that's what we're going to de-stash for now so i think that's going to be it for me today guys thank you so much for joining me on my vlog adventure today something a little bit different um practicing some vlog styles and capturing more movements in my daily life uh, i just really appreciate you coming along for the ride if you stuck this long i have a sense that this is a pretty long video already and well take care i'll catch you in the next one and hopefully that one will be a sketching video which I'm guessing is what you guys are here for. But I am also a whole self with a lot of different facets of my life. So I thought I would share those as well um, and just see how it works out. All right, bye guys, have a great day. And maybe if you're like a little bit overwhelmed with everything, um, try decluttering. I like literally just spent like the last two hours um, also decluttering a lot more. So even after recycling everything, I did come up with a whole bag of new recycled trash to give out um, as well as another full bag of like pots and pans that I don't use that I'm just gonna donate and it's quite nice quite relieving I don't see a difference in my flat at all I feel like it looks the exact same but hey gotta start somewhere all right catch you guys next time bye